How's it going guys? We're in Need for Speed 2015 and take a look what car I just picked up. That is the 2002 Nissan Silvia Spec R S15. We are going to fully customize this ride with the 55,000 credits that I basically have in this game to put into this car. Now unfortunately, I do not have access to the wrap editor. I don't even have access to paint this car. It's a little bit ridiculous, a little bit upset, but I can handle the white. I think the white looks nice and classic. So uh, that's basically what we're gonna have to stick with color wise is white, stock color, but visually and handling and performance, we will, uh, we will get right into. So let's get right into the hood already. Actually, first, let's see what kind of body kits we can add. A Rocket Bunny S15. Wow. It looks a little bit weird in my opinion. Oh, my God. I'm not I'm not a huge fan, to be honest. But, ooh, a Sea West body kit looks dope. I really like that. I really like the Sea West body kit. I think that's what we're going to put on this. To be fair, though, like we'll take another look. At the Rocket Bunny, it looks stupid. It looks, in my opinion, very, very hideous on this car. And there's no way I'm going to use that body kit. But this one, damn straight, I'm keeping this. Hood-wise, let's see what kind of different hoods. Damn, damn. I don't know. No, I'm going to keep the hood stock. I'm going to keep it stock. Some things I don't have unlocked, like the headlights, uh, front bumper. I can't. I don't have that unlocked yet. Let's adjust the stance, though. Lower this bitch ride height uh, I'm gonna leave right there track width Woo! I like that I like that we'll have some nice negative camber maybe the front not so much there we go. This thing looks sweet. Holy. Wow. Don't have the splitter unlocked yet. Actually, hold on. The reason why I can't adjust these parts is because of the body kit, I believe. So that's an obvious. But um, I'm happy with the body kit, in my opinion. I want to see around the back end. Wow. That's a sweet exhaust. Obviously, it came with the body kit. Um, that body kit made things very simple. Less things to actually do to this car. Um, you know what? Quickly. Let's just... Uh, can we remove it? No. Actually, we could. But I don't want to remove it. I'm happy with the way it looks, in my opinion. But, yeah. We could go through different parts and change them. But I'm not doing that because I love the way it looks. And I want to upgrade the rims, though. That's definitely going to happen. That's definitely happening. Uh, let's see what kind of rims I want to pick, though. Okay, not these. There we go. We're getting into some nice-looking rims now. Uh, I think we're back. I think we went through almost all of them. Rays. Yeah, these are the ones I'm looking for. Edit primary paint. See, now we can customize the paint. All right, we'll do, uh, since the color's, since the car's white, let's have some fun. Uh, that's a little bit too much. There we go. change size of rim we're gonna make yeah perfect 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 damn look at these man okay so the fronts are done now we just need to go to the rear uh, change the rim to the same one <clears throat> raise that's what they were there they oh my god there's <laughs> there's more than just uh than just the one i looked at but I think I did choose, actually, these are pretty nice, too. Damn. Damn, these are nice. Wow, I like, okay, so we have these on the front. But, but these look way nicer. I'm putting these on. Way nicer. And 
edit primary paint. All right, so. We have two different rim types on this car. That's okay, that's something different, right? So uh, I think that's the way we're gonna leave it. I think it looks pretty badass, actually. And uh, visually, I'm pretty happy with this car. There's not much more we can really do um, color-wise, even though I mentioned that already. I kind of really wish I could have uh, at least changed the color. But oh well, we'll go to the performance. This is where it's gonna get fun. Stock, 247 horsepower, top speed of 151 miles per hour let's slide this bitch so what kind of uh handbrakes can we add all right we're only up to like a level 15 so we can't do too much but we can do some things so whatever we can do we'll upgrade uh we'll put some nice drift tires on plus drift perfect oh my god i keep backing out okay diff uh adjustable diff is perfect Gives us the most flexibility in our tuning. Semi-adjustable suspension. We haven't even hit performance upgrade, like engine performance upgrades yet. Okay, we're gonna do an action nitrous because we'll be drifting a lot. So, time refill, action. Yeah, we'll do this one, 10 pounds. Uh, clutch obviously oh we can't upgrade the clutch no but we do have a performance clutch so that's not bad exhaust decatted let's go we'll put the decatted race exhaust on there and I keep backing out god damn all right now we're actually putting in some nice nice upgrades Hopefully I have enough money. Jeez. Jesus. Holy, holy camshaft. 301 horsepower right now. This is insane. I haven't even hit... Like, I want to add a turbo to this car. That's what's going to happen. Before I run out of money. We'll just add a basic... Basic turbo. Oh my god, this brings us to like 400 horsepower almost. That's insane. We'll put this one in though. It's cheap. We gotta save us some money for uh, for other upgrades. Ignition. ECU. Oh, keep backing out. Engine block. Let's see what we can do here. Damn, 413 horsepower. This car is flying. Holy air filter. That's an obvious. We need to put in at least a short ram air. We're at 422 horsepower. Sway bars. Honestly, there's like the cooling system. We'll, yeah, we'll put an intercooler. We do have a turbo, to be fair, so we should have that. Man, you just want to buy everything. It's so hard to hold yourself back. Oh. Okay. 450 horsepower basically this is gonna be sweet or 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 470 why not let's just basically we basically upgraded everything we could that's how it turned out to be just because just because we could so basically a 500 horsepower turbocharged Sylvia s15 this is sweet. Now let's get right into the handling. We want to make this obviously a drift build. So we are going to do that. Steering range. Oh, no, we want that on, on. We're going to have the diff locked. Okay, okay. I'm cool with the power since we're drifting. So, 
This is it. This is basically our C West Nissan Silvia S15 drift build in Need for Speed 2015. It looks pretty fucking sweet. I'm excited. Let's see how she does. Here we are, guys, in the S15, doing a Toge Drift event against Manu and some others. Through the single player, I've been just going through different uh, different events that I've had to do. And this is something new. This is the first Toge event I've done, and it is really, really cool. So basically, what you have to do is obviously try to get the most points you can <clears throat> also, while coming in first place out of all the other cars, it's a very, very cool. Uh, it's a very, very cool dynamic. It's uh, it's it's more than just drifting. You know what I mean? You constantly have to be going as fast as you can, and it's the thrill, especially going down these canyons. It can be very, very scary when you're taking some of these turns that are just so sharp and out of nowhere. But uh, it's definitely super fun. And if you guys noticed. There is a wing on the back of my car, and the license plate does say custom, hence my name. Yes, I know the wing wasn't there when I was customizing with you guys, because that's the reason why I completely forgot about the wing. I came out of the garage once I finished that whole, uh, that whole recording sesh, and I was like, wait a second, where's my wing? <laughs> like, this is ridiculous. So uh, I quickly went into the garage and, uh, and applied the first wing. Or basically, not the first wing, but the wing that I liked. And this is the one I liked. And it looks sweet. This car is phenomenal. A really, really, really awesome car. Like, oh, absolutely love this car. It's a beauty and it drifts amazing. I hope you guys enjoyed this second video of Need for Speed drifting and customization of this Sylvia S15. Let me know what you want to see next. Please leave a like, comment, and make sure you subscribe.